Texas Television. I'm Mason Smith here with Oliver Cox, Tyler Wolkowitz, all the rest of the FCAT crew. Thank you all for tuning in today. Um, it is a little bit windy today, but it's some pretty nice weather for a soccer game. It's the Western Mass semifinals. The Frontier Red Hawks are facing off against the Belgertown Orioles. Uh, just last night, uh, Frontier's football team had a tough loss against uh, Belgertown's football team. So a little bit of a, a rematch in a different sport for the Red Hawks. And of course, they're hoping to pull this off so that they can advance to the Western Mass finals, which will be happening uh, next week, I believe, or later this week, depending on when we post this video. Yeah. yeah. I think it's going to be an exciting game. I think so, too. But also, I do think Frontier is going to win. Yeah, I mean, they've had a really dominating season. They're 14-1, and one. 14 and one, oh, actually. 14-1 14 yeah. 14 14 was their final record um, for the regular season, and they won against Westfield Tech 5-1 to one, um, three days ago um, in the Western Mass quarter quarterfinals. And if, if they win here today, there's a decent chance they're going to be playing against uh, Hampshire, who is the only team that they lost to during the regular season. Ooh. So I'm hoping that I can get out, uh, that we can all get out to <laughs> cover that. Because oh, that's, yeah. that's going to be a lot of fun uh, and really exciting if they get to that point. All right, if, they, if, they, if that does happen, I will try to make it out there. Oh, yeah, definitely. It's a little windy today. Yeah, a little windy. I mean, thank you. Uh, the main thing that I don't like about the wind um, it just w is with the papers. I mean, <laughs> it's, I'm just trying to hold the roster straight in my hand, and it's just flying all over the place. But um, we'll try and get the names down quick so I can forget about it. Or we'll send the ball forward. That's Lockwood with it now. Looking to pass forward. He will. Kazoka will pass it back. Lockwood again. He's on the near side. All the way across the field, a header into the goalie box, and that was a nice clear by Valderrama. Kind of somersaults afterwards. Red Hawks fighting to get it out of their own side of the field. That's Frazier punching it forward. And Chani, a nice body there. Valderrama trying to stay up, and he'll get it to Chani. Centering pass to Chan Min now. He's looking for Fasulo down the field on the near side. There he is. Fasulo tries to work inside and goes down. Clean play. <laughs> wow, there's just a lot of pushing and shoving already. Yeah. Let's hope we don't get another yellow card from... Yeah. Him. Was it Valderrama? Or is it... um? Who is it that get, got suspended if they get another one? I didn't... Who's getting suspended if they get another one? I didn't hear about that. I'm pretty sure. Not really like maybe it was during the regular season, but I remember yeah. there was a player on our team who was a little too aggressive and got yeah. multiple yellow cards. I mean Valderrama has been very aggressive throughout uh the season. The last game we covered he didn't get a yellow card. We were talking about that a little bit. But um I mean, I wouldn't be surprised if the refs are a little bit more lenient with those calls today just because, I mean, it's Western Mass uh, playoff. Storm sends it in the goalie box, and it's grabbed by Mandeville. <laughs> Jack Mandeville. I love that name. Have you seen this guy with the pink, the little pink jersey down here? Yeah. What's going on? What is that? It's, it's a, is it a dog? Yeah, it's a dog. It's like a stuffed corgi, mm -hmm. I think is what it's supposed to be, if I know my dog breeds right, which it's, I very well might not. Um... Ball go out of bounds on the Orioles. <laughs> Sorry, I'm just, I'm just still laughing at this dog. Yeah, is, maybe during one of like the time, if there's a timeout or something or a stoppage of play, we could get a little shot of the guy on the sideline. Oh, that was a whistle from field hockey behind us. I keep the, mm -hmm. This is the second game that we've covered for soccer where there's a field hockey game going on behind us, and I'm getting confused by the whistles. That was from here. Yeah. As the ball goes out of bounds on the far side around midfield, Valderrama will hand it off to Garoppolo. Oh, no, it didn't go out of bounds. Yeah. It's a free kick. Valderrama got tripped. Oh. Um. Ball sent forward by Garoppolo over the head of everyone and into the hands of Mandeville. Bloop. I think that's the noise it makes. Yeah, it is an accurate representation. 
Queen it forward. That's Cayenne. Pass back. Now into the middle for the Orioles. He's going to try and send it forward. Chan, he is there to stop it, though. He'll work his way back. Pass forward to Valderrama. He can't keep it. Some nice footwork there. There's 21. That's Connor. Chase Connor. Headed forward by the Orioles. Tron Min fighting for it on the near side. Pass back to Storm and he'll clear it out. Looking for Palmer, but it's headed back. And Vasuro meets it with his chest. Near side, he loses the ball. There's a short pass that's kind of flubbed by the Orioles. And there's four guys around the ball right now. Pass back to Frazier. He tries to clear it, but it'll get intercepted. Far side of the field now. Pass forward. Belchtown might have an opportunity. There's a shot on goal. It's wide, and there was also a whistle. I think they're going to, there was like a, a push there. I think so. Against Lockwood. Yeah, they'll give Bab the goal kick. That was a little worrying right there for a yeah. moment. I got scared. Bab with a line drive down the field. Oof. Valderrama scrambling for it. Larson with it now. Tries to get it to Valderrama. He's on the far side. He'll have to pass it back. Jack Storm. Other side of the field now. Nice pass up to Fasulo. And Palmer's got a race for it. He won't get there in time though. Over the head of Lockwood. Belchertown keeps it in. The ball gets by Cachuango. Lockwood and Cachuango intercepts it. Garoppolo tries to clear it. It's still just up in the air and... <laughs> That kind of looked like the wind pushed it back a little bit. I don't know. Oh, yeah. The wind is definitely affecting the, the flight path of this ball. Yeah. Fasuro near side. Nice pass up to Palmer, but he can't hold on to it. Tron Min almost gets it. Palmer fighting for it. Some pushing and shoving that's happening out there. Oof. That was Connor who was fighting for it just a few moments ago for the Orioles. Pass up to Valderrama. He gets checked. He comes up with the ball, though. Far side. He goes down, and then so does an Orioles player. He's not happy about that call. That was Ian McDonald who went down with him. Let's see, I'm going to look at the Snapchat stories really quick. 9-5-3, and three, that's Belchertown's record. Oh, okay. okay. Is it, you know, everyone posts, like, come out to the game, and they got the records up there. Yeah, yeah. So Frontier definitely with a better record than Belchertown, but still, we're, this is a really great matchup so far. Um, Frontier hasn't had too many opportunities um, on uh, Belchertown's side of the field. Yeah. They've had a couple, but uh, Belchertown has had pretty much an equal amount. Yeah. We see a lot of aggressive play from Belchertown. Yeah. Rainer Christensen coming off. And coming on for him, that's number 12, Nathan Marino. Belchertown has some great names. They do, was, yeah. We were talking about that a little bit before. Ball goes out again. Another throw in for the Orioles. It's a good thing we have, um, uh, what are they called? Like the little wind masks that we have on the yeah. mics. There's a very high shot on goal. Goes way out of bounds. I thought that might go out of the track for a second even there. Even with these uh, little wind masks, you can still vaguely hear the wind. Yeah, you can. It's uh, I mean, it helps out a lot, that's for sure. Yeah. Bad with the goal kick out to midfield. Red Ox trying to push it forward. Chan He ball gets by him and Cachuango can't bring it down. He'll get knocked down and it's out on the Orioles. Garoppolo with a quick throw and forward to Valderrama. Shot up in the air and he'll head it forward. It's him against three Orioles and they'll clear it out. Nice header by Lockwood. Frazier with it now. He'll pass it back to Owen Babb. And he's got to get it away quick. Some nice pressure from Lockwood. Here's another opportunity for the Orioles. Shut down by Frazier. Fasula with it now. Near side. Oh, and a big wow. hit. Wow. Missy Azik. That's how I'm going to say it. Yeah, Josh Missy Azik. Oh, oh. That was some nice move. <laughs> yeah. Frontier will keep the ball after it goes out of bounds. Fasula will take the throw in. 
Oh no, he won't. He landed off the storm. Short throw in to Chan Min and a pass forward by Storm to Fasulo and it goes out again. Chan Min takes it. In the middle of the field, Palmer, he's trying to get it to Fasulo on the outside. It's sent back to Palmer, Oof. headed straight to the goalie. I don't know about straight to the goalie. Well, he ran to it, but still. <laughs> there wasn't really anyone there to make a play on it besides the goalie, so. Pass forward for the Orioles. On the near side now, good centering pass. Connor sends it to the far side. Valderrama got to make something happen and a nice slide nice. tackle. Cleared out by Storm and it'll go out of bounds. Oh no, that was, uh, that was Garoppolo, my fault. You know, I'm kind of surprised that they didn't uh, call a penalty on that slide tackle. No, I, I don't know, but it was a nice slide tackle. It was a nice slide tackle. It was definitely very effective. Valderrama heads it, stays in bounds, sent down the field, and Bab is going to scoop it up. Still a scoreless game. And we're 10 minutes in, and that is a pop fly of a punt. Not going as far as Bab would have liked it to. And that also looked like the wind pushed it back a little bit. Palmer yeah. can't get on top of the ball. Fasulo heads it back to him. Palmer, pass Ooh. forward too strong. You know, I think once uh, Frontier gets acclimated to the pressure being put onto them by these uh, defenders, I think it'll be perfectly fine. Because we've seen similar things. Uh, who was it? Who's last they played that we covered? Oh, I forget. Here's a nice pass. Chan He looking for Palmer, intercepted by the Orioles' defense. And that's what they need to do, just what you're saying. Another nice play by Valderrama, getting right on the ball. Yeah, but... Once they get like acclimated to the pressure, I think they'll start to find ways around it. Cause Absolutely. Whoever, whoever it is we they played last that we covered, we saw similar play styles and a lot of aggressiveness from the team. No, totally. It's very rare that we see the Red Ox pull ahead really early in the game. Yeah. And if they do, it tends to be a really phenomenal lucky play where things just kind of line up. But you're right. I think that once they kind of figure out the defense, they're able to penetrate it really, really well. Oh, and the ball goes through the legs of Fasulo. He keeps it in, and a nice pass looking for Palmer. He'll send it back to Chan He. Overshoots him a little bit, though. And Orioles will come up with the ball. They're on the near side now, pushing it forward, and it'll be sent too far ahead by Kyan. I don't even know how to say that first name. Look at that. Eset, maybe? Why do you think you do play-by-play? -play? <laughs> hey, listen, I did... I, I just guess most of the time. <laughs> I really do. Oh, and Palmer with an opportunity now. Valderrama gets it. Pass up to Palmer. Ugh. And that was meant for Valderrama. Not the best pass we've seen from him. Maybe some miscommunication. Catchwango will throw it forward for the throw-in. Valderrama will take it. Slows things down a little bit. Let his team... Get down the field. There's the throw in. Looking at Palmer. It gets by him and cleared out by the Orioles. Garoppolo calls it and heads it forward. And another header by Chan Min. Storm intercepts the pass by the Orioles. Fasula is right on top of it. It goes out of bounds on Frontier. They kind of just a little pinball action there. Yeah. Oh, look at that nice touch by Lockwood. That was impressive. Was yeah. <laughs> oh, okay. I see. I see. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Lockwood sends it forward in a centering pass. Valderrama catches it out of the air. Whoa! That was more of a trip up than a hit. Yeah. And that was nice. You don't see that often. Seemed like yeah, delayed yeah. penalty there. Yeah, and I mean, that, that's a good enough call. I don't think Valderrama meant any harm there. He helped yeah, the guy right. up afterwards. But now a free kick. That's going to be taken by the Orioles. Sent into the goalie box and right out of bounds. That was Trevor Weiss who took the kick. <laughs> <laughs> he does look kind of goofy bringing a pillow. He does, a little bit. That was his concern, but... We love you, Elijah. 
former world record holder, Elijah Rain Phelps, pulling up to the game right now. I'm glad I'm seeing a lot of people here, though. I mean, it's, yeah. it's a I playoff game, free yeah. admission. Like, why wouldn't you show up? And it's a beautiful day, too. It is. Catch Wonga with the ball. Not too hot, not too cold. No, and the wind definitely helps. Yeah. Pass back to Garoppolo, Catch Wongo, and he'll send it forward looking for Palmer, and it's cleared out of bounds by the Orioles. Beaujolais. It's a good thing I asked how to pronounce that because I would be, <laughs> I, I would be butchering that horribly. Eric Larson with the ball now. Pass over to Storm, and it gets under his foot out of bounds. Couple subs coming in for the Orioles. Wind starting to pick up a little. Oh yeah, Missy Isaac throws it in. Whistles blown. He stepped over the line, I think. Pretty sure. Or maybe he did it too far forward or something. Yeah, I think that's my, that might have been what it was. Throwing again. Lockwood heads it forward, and Grappler tries to clear it out. Knocked down. Fasulo. Can't send it forward, and it'll be kicked out of bounds. I think that was Kazoka on the play. Jack Storm with the throw in, and Fasulo can't bring it down. It's out. All right. There's Lockwood again. Stepping all the way back to the Red Ox speaker. Big throw in into the goal box, and Catch Wong's going to have to head it out of there. Nice second touch by Sean Min and Valderrama. Oh, he can't bring it down. Tripped up a little on the ball, and oof, that went right off of his face. Ooh, that not good. He might have gotten kicked right on the knee. I, I, you can hear him scream. Yeah, he's holding his knee. I think that's what happens. Uh oh. They're going to take a break on the field to tend to Chani, hope he's okay. Uh, Tyler, let's shift over and take a look at that Corgi over there we were talking about earlier. But, uh, yeah, I, I think, is that your first time seeing it? Yeah, <laughs> Tyler has a, an expression of childlike wonder on his face right now. <laughs> so, no, we didn't, even, we didn't need to take a break. I did want to focus on the corner for a second, though. Yeah, yeah, Garoppolo yeah. sends it forward and headed out of bounds. It's going to be a corner kick for the Red Hawks. That was Ian McDonald who last touched it from the Orioles. Now, yeah, you can really hear the wind now, even on the headsets with the wind masks. Going to try and cover it a little. Just a little bit, yeah. There you go. That's a little better. <laughs> but now we sound all goofy. Yeah, it, it'll, it makes it a little weird. John, he's going to take the throw. And oh, look at that. The wind's died down a little bit. You can't hear it as much. Here's the kick from John. He headed out by the Orioles. Storm chasing it down. Kicks it behind him. Larson's there. Nice touch. Can he oh. go Whoa. <laughs> what a hit there. On the near side, trying to keep it in. Some nice footwork. Pass back to Storm. He's got a little bit of room, and it'll go out of bounds on him. Ooh. Larson was kind of had some good movement there. Yeah, he did. Lockwood. Uh, it looks like he stepped out of bounds. I was going to say that's another great touch for, by him on the sideline. He did that before to keep the ball in. Storm's going to take the throw in at midfield. Fasulo trying to keep it in. It'll be out on the Orioles. 24 minutes left in the first half of the game. Jack Storm oh, wow. moving forward. Gets taken down. No whistle there. And it's sent forward to Lockwood. Nice pass up. Cachuango's there. He's going to pass it oh, forward to Owen Babb. No. Babb, beautiful save. Oh, my God. That was almost really bad. A bit of a flood pass by Cachuango, but did not phase Owen Babb. Now Chun Yi with oh, an opportunity. Yeah. Train's coming by. Awesome. Pass behind Palmer. That's unfortunate. And cleared out. Sent forward by Larson and out of bounds. Rev is right there to grab it. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, what an incredible save. Yeah. That got me a little scared there. Yeah, <laughs> I'm gonna be honest. 
that's the second time we've seen a one-on-one -on -one with the goalie in this game. Fasumo and Shawnee, he, he just kind of jumped right <laughs> over the ball there. I think he was trying to send it forward with a, a some kind of unique touch, but it <laughs> didn't really work out. <laughs> Shawnee receives the throw-in, dancing around the defenders, and now Lockwood pass forward. Frazier going to let it go out. Storm will take the throw for the Red Hawks. Gets it to Chan He again, and it's out of bounds. I think that'll be a Red Hawks throw again. Mm, no, no it won't. I've seen a lot of, like, I don't know if I just haven't been noticing it, but I feel like only Belcher Towns had subbed in this. No, game. Frontier hasn't subbed in one player yet. There's different strategies, I guess. Bab grabs it out of the air and heaves it down the field to Valderrama. Look at that throw. Wow. Oh, oh my no. God, no. Valderrama can't get the pass off, and he'll have to send it to Larson. He'll send it for Oh, what a pass by Chun Min. Can't quite get it to Palmer, though. I mean, you got to give credit where credit's due, Oliver, and Belchertown has put up an amazing defense so far what in this game. Noise? I think it's the train. I don't know. Mandeville calls off the defense and scoops up the ball. Rolls it over. Palmer trying to track it down. On the far side, he'll send it forward. Lockwood is there. Got a pass up. Jack Storm fighting for it. Frazier will clear it out. Wow. Palmer going to chase it down. Can't get to it in time. It'll be passed back to Mandeville. Mandeville passes it over to the far side of the field. Nathan Marino. Sends it over, and Fasulo is right there to receive the pass. Fasulo takes it the other way, near side, and it goes out of bounds. I thought that was going to take off the coach's head. I <laughs> okay. All right. A little bit of a miscommunication there. Yeah, I don't really know what happened. <laughs> Throw into Fasulo. Storm gets it back. Moves it to the outside. Looking for someone to pass to. He'll try and find Fasulo. And it's, stayed in, it's kept in bounds by the Orioles. They got to clear it out now. They almost will. Larson stops it. Chan Min now. Got to pass it forward. And it's headed forward and out of bounds. Good throw in taken by Jack Storm. All right, back where we started. Yeah, who's he looking for? Palmer in the goal box, near side, works out of it. In the corner now, sends it forward and over the goal. And another sub coming in for the Orioles. Uh, yeah, I think it just has to do with um, a different strategy by the coach, just, you know, keeping all of the players relatively fresh. Yeah. Maybe it's just not a concern for the Red Hawks. I don't know enough about soccer strategy to really make a call on that, I yeah. guess. Valderrama with an interestingly positioned header there. Fasulo sends it forward looking for Valderrama and it'll go over the head of Palmer. Out of bounds. Missy Isaac sends it forward. Lockwood is there. Nice touch, and he's oh. <laughs> I, that, that was that was definitely a push by Frazier, but I don't think that it would have really knocked him over. He just kind of went limp. <laughs> that was that was yeah, pretty funny. Yeah, <laughs> it looked a little goofy. Yeah, <laughs> a little silly. Even. Maybe even Cookie. Trevor Weiss takes the free kick, sends it forward. Owen Bab takes it out of the air. Nice little shot. It's like, what do they call? Oh, look at that! Did you see that? <laughs> he did. That was quite a trap there. John Min is bringing the ball to a dead stop. Nice header by Frazier. He goes up for it again. Collides a little with John Min. John He sending it forward for Valderrama and a little bit too far. Valderrama gives him a thumbs up. 
I think I found a better way to hold the, the roster. June doesn't... Yeah, it's not as wide, so then it doesn't flap around as much. Five guys fighting for the ball. Now, Kachuwango is going to get his leg around to everyone and try and clear it out, but it'll get sent right back in. Connor sends it forward. And a pass back. Kazoka. It's out of bounds on Kazoka. Throw in. Missy Azic is right there. Kyan. And now trying to heave it. There's a whistle blown. It'll be a free kick for the Orioles. What happened there? I do not know. Maybe like a delayed penalty or something? I have no, yeah, I have no idea. I mean, I just don't know. Like, I really don't know too many penalties for soccer. Here's the kick. Oh! Bab getting a deflection there oh. just in time. Bit of a collision on the header there, too. This is a very physical game today, and it's still scoreless. Oh! oh. Did you see that? <laughs> yeah, that was a great effort by Larson sending it forward. Cachuango pops it up. John He will send it forward looking for Palmer, and it's way too far of a pass. Mandeville will be there, and he picks it up. Yeah. Mandeville taking his time, and he finally <laughs> punts it off. Met with a header by Larson. Fasulo chips it forward to Palmer, who heads it over to the far side of the field. Valderrama with it now. He's looking to send it forward. Palmer looks like he's going to get to it. No, Yes, he will. And he can't get the angle on the ball to center it to Fasulo. It is getting a little chilly. I might have to put my uh, jacket back on soon. It'll be, oh, we got a corner kick. I thought it went out on uh, Palmer, but that's going to be Valderrama taking the corner kick for the Red Hawks. Here it comes into the goalie box across to the other side, and Sean Min is there. Out of bounds again. We are all bundled up. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Storm can't quite pass it forward. It will be cleared out. John He fighting for it. He'll come out on top. Can he work it forward though? He's brought down and cleared out again by the Orioles. It'll go out of bounds and a throw for the Red Hawks. Whoa. Big effort there by Trevor Weiss to send the ball forward. And now it's going to end up with Valderrama who can't keep it in. And another sub coming in. Another one? Wow. Yeah, we need to start keeping track, man. I mean, Red Hawks have not subbed in one player at all. They usually do a decent amount of subs in the second half, though. That's what yeah, I've noticed. Yeah. They go pretty strong with their starters. Yeah, with their starters uh, in the first half. Yeah, handball. Yeah. <laughs> it wasn't no, on purpose, though. It looked like it rolled up his leg. Yeah. John Min trying to get it to his brother, and it's sent back by Weiss. Frazier, pass up to Larson, scoots by him a little bit, and he can't hold on to it. It will stay in bounds. Weiss against Larson, and John, he's going to be fighting for it now. Fasulo can't get it around the defender, has to head it to keep it in, and it's out. That will be out on Belchertown. Interest I I could have sworn that was out on Fasulo. Oh. Palmer. Ooh. He's fine for it. Might have an opportunity here. Pushing and shoving on the near side, and it's out on him. Unfortunate. Yeah. Throw in for the Orioles. Right in the corner, too. Send it downfield. Fasulo is right there. No one to head it to, and it's cleared out to Lockwood. Nice centering pass by Lockwood. There's another good pass. Cachuango, one-on-one. Some nice footwork. And whoa, whoa, whoa. I think the ball hit the ref there. Yeah. Oh, they're going to call. Oh, okay, I see. 
Oh, it hit the ref, but he said he was going to go out of bounds, so they're giving him a throw-in. Yeah, that was a nice slide tackle. Yeah, that was a beauty of a slide tackle. Valderrama heads it down, sent forward, and Bab is there. A lot of shots on goal Yeah. by the Orioles. You don't see that a lot with the Red Hawks defense. Or at least we haven't really seen it in the past. Vasulo gets the header off. Not sure how, he didn't even really jump. Throw in. Gonna be taken by Missy Azik. Met by Tron Min, Fasulo. They're gonna say, oh, hey. Oh, a little bit of a wait, uh, late whistle for out of bounds, I think. Ref saying that's on me. Missy Azik with the throw in, sent back to him. Whoa, Armour! Putting his body on and Tron Yi checked out of the air. And yeah, that'll be a penalty. Free kick for the Red Hawks. I love the effort from both sides. Oh yeah. Everyone is really giving it their all today. And we even got a couple fans from Belchertown. Not as many as from the football no. game, but... Frazier takes the free kick, sends in the goalie box. Palmer's looking at it, and Mandeville. Nice play there. You know, something tells me that we have some Belcher Town, Town fans on this side. Yeah, I think you're right. And I think it's quite a few, actually. Yeah, it makes me wonder why some of them go to the other side and then some over here. Yeah, I don't know. Valderrama can't keep it. And that'll be a whistle on him. He's upset with himself. Or the, just upset with the call, I'm not sure. <laughs> Get that man on the football team. Yeah, that was a nice throw. Come on. That was a perfect spiral. Jeez. <laughs> <laughs> nice centering pass, but Bab is there to scoop it up. And Bab, what a punt. Palmer can't bring it down, though. And Mandeville from one end of the field to the other. Short roll over to one of his defenders, and Garoppolo kicks it out of the air. Larson trying to send it forward, but there's no one there for it. Tron Min steals the ball, pass up to Fasulo. Nice footwork there. Can you get to it in time? No, he won't. No, it's something we don't really pay attention to, and I just saw the number seven there. Oh, he put on a nice little screen. Yeah. I it's guess you only really... You only really focus on what's happening around the ball. Yeah. Right? Nothing, nothing really else. But Look at this. Valderrama trying to get to it. He can't, but it will be a throw for the Red Hawks. That was a nice opportunity there. Four forwards moving forward right in line with each other. Anything could have happened there. Just some good defense by Beaujolais. Now the throw in is met by Chani. Mm. He's brought down. Valderrama. I think that might be a free kick. I think so. Oh, look at this opportunity for the Red Hawks. Yeah. It's a big one. They've been uh, letting Boucher Town get a lot of shots on goal. And <laughs> if they could get some points on the board, it could really change the flow of the game. As we're coming down to the final 10 minutes of the first half. Sean He will take the free kick. Palmer! Oh my goodness! The roll into the goal after the miss header, but Mandeville deflects it out of bounds, and I think it'll be another corner for the Red Hawks. Yeah. So from one side of the field to the other. <laughs> and look at that. Did you see that? That was perfect. He did like. That was nothing, man. He didn't even try. <laughs> oh, just a little touch. There you go. Right, right, right exactly right. where it needed to be. <laughs> John He will take the f corner kick again. Grounds it over to Valderrama. Oh, nice touch, oh. and Fasulo misses the net. Oh. Oh. Hey, Elijah, get a sip. <laughs> what are you moseying around? Some tough luck for the Red Hawks there. 
could have gave him the lead. That's what I it said. It is really watered down, yeah. It's not terrible, though. I mean, it tastes like actual real tea. Boring. <laughs> <laughs> I need 56 grams of added sugar. John Man heads it forward. Palmer can't bring it down, and it's cleared out by Beaujolais. Cachuango got to chase it down now, and he'll send it out. I'm not sure exactly what happened over there. Yeah, I was too busy reading the label. That's fair. I needed to see how many grams of sugar was in that thing. Yeah. It was seven. Now the wind's really picking up again. <laughs> Throwing by Valderrama, looking for Chan He. Chan Min will end up with it. Frazier now. Got to clear it out. He finds Fasulo. Nice little touch over to Chan Min. Chan He now, middle of the field. He'll pass it over to the far side. Valderrama looking to send it forward. Oh. A little too far, maybe? Yeah. Now Chan Min got to chase him down. Nice pass forward. They're looking for Lockwood now. And a good clear sent out of the track by Frazier. Wait. What is he yelling wait for? <laughs> oh, you got to let the team get down. You got a good position throwing. There it is. A, Header, and it goes out of bounds just wide of the net. It's always so scary when that happens. Yeah. I don't think it would have mattered too much. Bab was right there for it. Six minutes left in the first oh, half, and we got a couple people tying their shoes, fixing their shin guards. Uh oh, the sun's coming out, it looks like. Oh. It's gonna be fun for me. <laughs> Ball's brought down by the Orioles. Valderrama fighting for it, and it's cleared out by Weiss, and Bab scoops it up. I'm standing now. Yeah. Look at that punt. Wow. Way downfield. Oh. Palmer might have an opportunity here. He'll get to it in time, but it might be out of bounds on him. It's going to be Ooh, close. Wow. Yeah. yeah that, um, unfortunate. Womp womp. I mean, that would, that, if he had scored a goal there, that would just would have been an assist from Owen Bad, <laughs> which would have been crazy. <laughs> <laughs> Storm trying to send it forward. Intercepted. And now oh, oh. here's an opportunity for Lockwood. Slows it down a little bit against Garoppolo. Sent forward, and Bab just grabs it out of the air and heaves it downfield to Valderrama. He can't keep it. Oh, and he's taken down hard. What happened there? They just kind of got tangled up. Looked like sort of crossed over each other. I feel like, now it sounds like I'm speaking over an inter, like intercom or something. Oh, we're, we're Frontier's finally bringing in a sub. Look at that. Ian Paturk on the sideline. You're right. John, he sends it forward, and it's deflected out of bounds, it looks like, so it'll be another corner kick for the Red Hawks on the near side of the field. Mm, 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 mm. I think we need our pet band back. That's what we're missing. Yeah, we do. That, I was thinking about that last night. That's going to be the one thing that's going to be unfortunate about uh, covering this game. We aren't going to have our marching band here with us. I don't know if they'll do any more games this season because they only really cover, uh, they only really do uh, football games. Here's the kick from Tron E. Oh, Armour deflected by Mandeville and a great save. That was a beautifully placed kick by Tron E. Yeah. Wind is really going out. My God. And oh the sun's coming out, oh too. God. <laughs> yeah, there you go. It just hit your face. Lockwood, nice, <laughs> sends it forward. Uh oh. Wow, look at that. <laughs> <laughs> that was Jack Sullivan who was trying to move it forward for. Oh my god. Oh my, oh my We're going to get blown off the top of the press box, man. Are you kidding me? This is ridiculous. Jesus. This is really going to... Somehow, the, I feel like the audio isn't really suffering all that much, you know? You can just, like, hear it. You can hear it, but it's not, like, making it impossible to hear our voices, which is really interesting. Here's a corner for the Orioles, and all the way to Lockwood across the field. Catchwango and Garoppolo. Oh, right. oh, oh, my God. Oh, everything's going horrible. <laughs> we got it. We got it. Everything's fine. 
throwing going to be taken by the Orioles. I was worried that was going to be a penalty kick for a second. I didn't even realize my notebook was flying all over the place. Yeah. I was looking at the field. Here's a throw by Lockwood. Catruongo heads it, and Palmer can't clear it. Sent to the goal, and cleared out by Frazier. Sullivan was there trying to make a play again. Another throw in near side this time. Lockwood takes it, sent to the goal box, and cleared by the Red Hawks. Palmer comes up with it. Palmer has two defenders to beat, and it's cleared out by the last one. Tron Min, nice touch, sends it forward. Palmer's there again. Oh, oh, oh. keep with the ball. <laughs> sends it forward to Tron He, and now he uses a pass to Fasulo. He'll lay off of it, and it'll be a corner kick for the Red Hawks. Look at this, from one side of the field to the other. Corner. You know what I've noticed? What? Multiple times in this game has Palmer been in the situation where it's just like him and a couple other dudes. Yeah. A couple other guys. He's just always there. He's always there. He is always there. He's just got to put the right moves on him, and it'll work out. He's done that plenty of times this season. Corner kick from the near side. John, he takes it. Sent all the way across the field. Palmer heads it forward. And now Valderrama, can he get to it in time? He will. He'll slow it down a little. And now he's surrounded. Sends it right into the middle, and it's cleared out. Jack Storm is going to be there for the Red Hawks. Takes it to the oh. outside, and whoa. Almost hit him in his face. I mean, I don't blame him for trying to Wait, punch the ball. Did that not hit him in the face? I think he swatted it down with his hands. Oh. Which is why I don't... Kirk finally gets to come in. Comes in for like he's Roscoe been Palmer. Before. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that is, he's coming in as we... Now are under two minutes left to play in the first half. Throw in by Storm to Chan He. He's got some room to work, but it'll get cleared out by the Orioles. I don't know why I sat down. Uh, yeah, I don't know why either. It's blaring in my face. Valderrama meets the ball, gives himself a little bit of room, sends it forward. Oh, I thought that was going right oh. to Chan What a play there. I'm going to call it. Hey, I'm going to call that a penalty? I think that was. Yeah, I agree with that guy down there. Yeah. Ball like was that down was, on the field. I feel like that was a perfect slide tackle. But I thought that was a great connect, slide he tackle, connected yeah. with the ball before anything. And if anything, I'm pretty sure that, I think that's the end of it. Yeah, the they're going to call that the end of the first half. Just a great start. God, so yeah. Um, we are going to do much more recap because of that. Uh, because of the wind. It's 0-0. Zero to zero. Uh, we'll be back in just a few moments with uh, the second half of this Western Mass semifinals game. Because it's a playoff game, if the score doesn't change or if we end up tied at the end of regulation, we're going to be ending up going to overtime, Oof. I think is uh, the protocol. They, have, um, they might have shootouts. Do they I don't have, know. You, you should, you should a, look that up. If they have a shootout, that could be... That, that might be one of the most exciting things I've seen all year. So, score is tied at... Zero as we end the first half. Frontier Red Hawks against the Belchertown Orioles. You're watching Frontier Community Access Television. Hello, and welcome back to Frontier Community Access Television. I'm Mason Smith. We're still here with Oliver Cox, Yo. Tyler Wolkowitz, Elijah Rain Phelps, all the rest of the FCAT crew. The game is still scoreless. It's the start of the second half. Um, Frontier is going to be uh, starting with the ball, or at least they're going to uh, kick the ball off. Um, John He gets the pass, sends it <laughs> way downfield <laughs> to no one in particular, but Valderrama will intercept the clearing pass and send it right towards the oh, goal. Oh, okay. <laughs> good way to start this. Yeah, game. this is good instincts, man. Mandeville almost couldn't grab that, too, so, you know. So we, we did look up the rules and regulations of high school soccer, and it looks like they'll do an overtime round first, and then if that doesn't work out, they might go to a shootout, although I'm, I'm not 100% sure. They were kind of vague about it. And it, if it goes to a shootout, I don't know. I might not be able to. Like, I like. I'm going to be losing my mind every <laughs> single shot, man. It's yeah. going to... It's a playoff game. You can't end on a tie, and I wouldn't be surprised at all if regulation ends with no score because these teams are both oh, so oh maybe not oh Valderrama yeah. he had an opportunity but it was taken away from him whoa, <laughs> <Pushes> whoa. him <laughs> <laughs> all right
Belchertown knows that Valderrama is getting a little testy. Yeah. <laughs> now it's like start of the second half. You still haven't scored a goal. He's gonna be upset about it, and they know that. Yeah. Ooh. He oh. had to just brought down. No whistle. The ref was standing <laughs> right there, so I, evidently that was a clean play. He had a, he had a whole man land on him, and he got up like nothing. Yeah. <laughs> John Man, nice footwork by Lockwood. Try to get it up to Fasulo, but he's not there in time. John Min runs up to it again. Nice header up to Palmer. Oh, okay. Ooh, Palmer, I boy. thought he was going to pass it over to yeah. Valderrama on Me the near too. side. Now it's passed forward and out of bounds by the Orioles. And I hope I'm not, I, I hope I'm uh, enunciating the L enough because Elijah was telling me during the uh, halftime that I, he thought that I was saying the Belchertown Oreos. So I hope that I am saying Ooh. the Orioles Bit of a most of the time. Pass. Yeah. Sean Min. Cachuango comes up. Nice pass to Valderrama. He's looking across the field, I think. Pass back to Larson. John He can't quite bring it down. Larson sends it forward. Fasulo racing after it. He can't get there in time and it will be a throw for the Red Hawks. Fasulo takes his time. Pass back to Chan He. Nice footwork. Oh, wow. Sent towards the goal, and it's out of bounds. Wide left. Some good opportunities for the Red Hawks to start off the half, though. Yeah. That's something you want to see. The sun go away. I know. It is. I mean, I mean, if you look over to our right, that is not, <laughs> not promising. No, it's a bunch of very dark clouds. Um, and we're right in the middle of like the split between like the partly cloudy, beautiful day, and then the looming dark clouds on our right. Oh, nice head! <laughs> that was a nice head. That was Chan Min there. Valderrama comes up with the ball. Pass back. Larson wasn't really there. He has to race for it. Frazier sends it forward, looking for Vasulo, and Larson sends it forward. Cleared out by Belchertown, and Frazier's got to run back for it. He gets checked after the ball is sent out of bounds. I think that'll be a throw for the Red Hawks, yeah. yeah. Oh, uh, <laughs> I know, he keeps up. chasing you, man. All right. That was a Jacob Ladu who was up against him there. I gotta take off the sweater again. <laughs> <laughs> Just going back and forth. It's too cold. Now it's too hot. Yeah. It's still, I mean, it's, at least it's not too hot the whole time, and we're just yeah. sweating up here, and we aren't even, like, doing anything. <laughs> that was an interesting sound. Uh, yeah, well, I didn't <laughs> hear it, now did I? <laughs> oh, no, it's... Ugh. Lockwood sends it forward. Oh! Bab calls off the defense and scoops it up. You know, if it does go to a shootout, though, I'm going to be freaking out, but I have, com I have total confidence in no, Owen Babb. Yeah. He's a tall man. He can cover like half the goal just by. Oh, whoa! I don't. I that was a <laughs> big hit, but I don't think that was really intentional. No. By Palmer, he was just going for the ball. What a nice! Oh, beautifully, almost like perfectly placed kick. Yeah, that's gonna be out on Cachuango though. <laughs> oh. No. What? What are you looking for? I keep trying. I keep checking to see if the sun's gone. <laughs> Lockwood with the throw in. Intercepted by Valderrama. He's going to have to clear it out. And it's out of bounds on the Orioles, so he'll take the throw in. Sends it down fast. Intercepted by Lockwood. And out of bounds on Tron He. Lockwood will get the throw in again. Short. Sent back to him. Centering pass. Gets through just about everyone except for Jack Storm, who will clear it out. Sent back into the goal box. And Cachuango's there. He's got to clear it out. He won't completely, but Valderrama gets another opportunity here on the near side, and Ooh. it's sent off the chin of <laughs> number 12, Nathan Marino. And the Red Hawks have given themselves a little bit of breathing room here. Cachuango goes up for the header and kind of brings down. Um, that's Ian McDonald. Oh, okay. Yeah. What happened there? Is it just what Ben did? Yeah, I think okay. so. Okay. Free kick sent forward. Oh, oh, oh. And Cachuango. What a Ooh. save. Oh, my <laughs> God. Oh, my God. Some really good opportunities for the Orioles here. Storm clears it out, and it's out of bounds. 
Oh, and I guess it deflected off of Looks someone from Boucher down. Must have been. Yeah. Throwing downfield. Fasulo. Nice pass to Chan Yi. He works down the field. Chan Yi works it back. Pass forward. Fasulo. And it's too far ahead of him. It's a shame. That's been happening a lot. Just the yeah. pass. They get a little bit too excited and just send it too far ahead. Larson pops it up. John, he's going to go up for the header, and he lets it drop. Going back and forth, finds his way forward. His shin guard fell out, it looked like, or someone's did. It's lying on the field right now. Palmer chasing after it, and it's cleared out by the Orioles. Larson trying to bring it down, but he can't. They'll send it downfield, and Cachuango meets it and clears it out. And Marino will let it go out of bounds. Oh, headed out. Whoa, hey, look at that. <laughs> Some, who's shin guard? It's, it's, just I, it's, it's just out on the field. I don't know. Let's hope it doesn't result in someone getting hurt or something. <laughs> yeah. Is that a shin guard? No, it is. I saw it pop out of their sock. I don't know who's a, Do you who know was. Side? Or is it just like... Lockwood takes the throw in. Valderrama I can't get the header off. And Storm going to have to clear it out. Bab was trying to call him off, but they did what they could. Belcher Town putting a lot of pressure on the Red Ox, mm -hmm. trying to make him crack. Crone will be taken by Lockwood on the far side now. You know, as much as I, like, understand keeping your best players in, it looks like they, some of them might be getting a little tired. Definitely, I I agree, and I think it could be some time, some time for like some substitutions. Well, there you go. Look at that. Max Moret, uh, talking to his coach right now. Evan Horton. It looks like he's not gonna be subbed in, but he might be considering it. I think it might be a smart thing to do. Yeah. Um. Yeah. There's Max. Well, like he's uh, warming up on the sideline right now. I mean, you got plenty of great players on the sideline for the Red Hawks. Mm -hmm. Nice deflection there by Josh Gladeau. Catchwango on the near side. Got to clear it out. He will. Intercepted by the Orioles. Pass forward is out of bounds and a throw in for the Red Hawks. Nope, not for the Red Hawks. It's going to be a throw in for the Orioles. I'm not sure why. I didn't yeah, really see that. But Lockwood will take it again. Seems to be their designated uh, throwing guy. Uh, there's got to be some kind of technical term for that. Oh, there's a bug on the back of my neck. Lockwood, yeah. long throw in. Frazier and Valderrama. Oh, nice clear. Headed out. And Sean He clears it. Palmer, oh. fighting for oh. it. Oh. And now Larson comes up with uh -oh. it. Oh, Stumbles uh -oh. a little. Oh, okay. He'll get it off. Great effort there. And Lockwood with some nice defense, setting it forward for his team. Looking for McDonald. Cachuango up against him, and he, he's just got to clear it out again. Yeah. Out of bounds. Not getting a lot of support on defense. No, 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 no. I think that's the main problem I'm seeing from the Red Hawks this game. That and uh, overshooting their passes. Mm -hmm. I think they need to be just as aggressive as Belcher Town is being. Yeah. Match their energy. <laughs> Bad <laughs> scoops up the <laughs> shot. <laughs> that was scary. <laughs> that was. <laughs> We've had plenty of those moments this game, and I don't like it one bit. Yeah. Bab pops it up. Fasulo kind of boxes out his defender, works to the far side, and sent out of bounds by Lockwood. Storm will take the throw in. Doesn't waste any time and tries to get it to Palmer, but it's headed out of bounds, so he'll take another throw in. About 15 yards down the field. <laughs> Short one this time to Chan Min. Back to Storm. Center to Palmer. And it's going to go into the hands of Mandeville. I've barely said his name this second quarter. Yeah. Which, you know, doesn't speak well to the Red Hawks so far. Valderrama. Mm. Can't quite stop it and rolls back, but yeah. Garoppolo will clear it out. Headed forward by the Orioles' defense. And now Cachuango Ooh, again. Nice. Ball gets under his leg, and Garoppolo. Larson's got to fight for it. Gets over his head, and now Chan He. Orioles send it forward. 
McDonald, near side. He's in the corner now up against Cachawango. Nice. Cachawango bodies him and he goes out of bounds. Some great defense we've been seeing from Cachawango. He's yeah. helped the Red Hawks a lot this game, especially in the 10, 12 minutes or so we've seen of the second half so far. I feel like I've definitely said second quarter a couple times and just not realized it. I think you probably have. Yeah. Here's the corner kick. Sent right into the middle. <laughs> and Garoppolo and Cachuango help to clear it out. It'll be a goal kick for Owen Babb. You know, it seems like a complete opposite of what happened last period where we had like 12 corner kicks from um, the Red Hawks side. Oh, and here you go. Ben. Giving Cachuango a bit of a break. He's been working hard out on the field. Max mm -hmm. Millet's going to come on for him. Nice round of applause for him, and he definitely deserves it. Yeah. <laughs> He's done his part, and I don't doubt that he'll end up back on the field pretty soon. Line drive of a kick Ooh. by Bab. Nice pass by McDonald, intercepted by Garoppolo, and Larson sends it forward. Palmer, oh, nice oh, touch. Oh, he wow. stays on top of it. Palmer's got some guys to pass to. Kind of oh, a little, and Sean He now, one guy in front of him in the goalie oh, box. Let's see what he can do. He's got to stop before it goes out of bounds. And it uh, does go out of bounds. They're going to call him on that. <sighs> Jeez. That was... He evidently thought that it didn't go out of bounds. Yeah. It seemed like the ref was kind of relying Take on the this. defender. Yeah, go ahead. Take a sip of that. Take, I've taken multiple. I think, I, I, I think I've drank more of this. Yeah, you probably out. have. <laughs> and that's the kind of opportunity that the Red Hawks need to create more often if they want to get an advantage in this close game. I love high fructose corn syrup. <laughs> uh, that'll be a free kick that's going to be taken. What happened there? I think it was just a push off. Okay. I didn't like it. White oh, sends man. it forward. Millette intercepts it. Can't really clear it out. And it's sent back to Garoppolo who heads it straight up. And I'll have to try to head it again. Weiss Ooh. in front of the goal. Oh, okay. Whew. And Lockwood sends it it's through good. the uprights. No, <laughs> We make that joke too much, too and we still we still think we're so funny. <laughs> it's because we are. Yeah. And would you look at that? The wind stopped. Yeah, and but now the sun's out. Yeah, the sun is out, but. <laughs> Bab is gonna take a break from the goal kicks. Garoppolo is gonna take it for him, I think. Yeah. Nice kick from Garoppolo. Charmin has to send it forward. Palmer can't quite bring it down. I think they're going to call a handball on him. Uh, yeah, I can see that. <sighs> CJ Rivers is going to be taking the free kick. And Frazier knocks a guy down. Trying to clear it out. Larson getting pushed around. And now Valderrama has to head it forward. Heads it behind him in the right direction, though. Palmer racing for it. They're on the sideline. Mandeville will have to get it away quick. Palmer's heading straight for Ooh, him. Whoa. And a nice little fake out there, but a great effort from Palmer nonetheless. Near the field, he takes him down. Is that going to be a yellow card? It oh, might yeah. be. Yeah, it is. They're going to card Palmer on that. <laughs> that was Beaujolais who went down. It's a shame. And it'll be a uh, free no. kick. What's that? Like, what, are you, what happens when you get yellow card? How long do you have well, to do you, if you, you get gone the, the, the thing is, if you get two yellow cards, you're ejected from the game. You're out of there. Yeah, but what about, like, how long did, can does he have to stay out with just the one? With just the one? Mm-hmm. Um, I don't know. Well, yeah, I think he, he has to sit out for a little bit. Um, I'm not sure exactly what I would imagine the time yeah. value is for that, but Rivers sends it way downfield, headed by Larson, and Fasulo brings it down. Fasulo on the far side tries to clear it out. It's blocked. And now Chan He ends up with it. Tries to pass it over to Chan Min too far behind him. And there's a cr cr pass across the field. Bolette kind of giving Bab a screen there, and he'll bowl it over to.
to Valderrama. Oh, what a touch there. Look at that. That was a beauty. Sends it forward to Chan He, but Lockwood is there to bring it down. And Bab will grab it again. Can the wind come back? Yeah. I well, it's, it. it's a gentle breeze right now, and I'll appreciate it. Chan He wow. heads it over to Valderrama. Touch back. Oh, whoa, whoa, okay. Him. No whistle. I don't know how whistle. I feel. He kind of yeah, really shoved that guy. Yeah. I feel like that's like... I don't know how I feel about that one. I don't... Yeah. I th yeah. My, he's on... He's like on my, like my team, but I still... I don't know about that one. Yeah. Because that one looked very like... It like did look... Like, yeah. I agree with that. River is going to be taking the free kick again from behind midfield. And Bab just catches it out of the air. Hurls it downfield. There's Fasulo. Fasulo going to be looking for Pachuric if he gets a pass off. Slow it down. And he can't keep it in. Oh. Sub coming in for the Orioles. And they can't do the hurry up offense that they wanted to. That's just been happening way too much. You get a nice opportunity on offense, and you can't keep it in bounds, and mm -hmm. it's just really disappointing. Patrick doing a great job putting Whoa, some wow. pressure on the defense. The vertical on that jump. Larson, pass forward to Chan He. He's got some people to work with. Valderrama, opportunity here. Might be looking oh. for a centering pass. He can't get it past the defense, though. And he falls down right on top of the ball. And look at him diving for it. Wow. <laughs> really? He's put everything he's, Yeah, he's giving it. it his all. Lockwood sends it forward and way out of bounds. Way. That landed on the track. The wind is back. Yeah. And it'll actually go out of the track. Throw in by Millette. Stays in bounds. Pachuric gets to it. Keeps it in bounds. And it's still in bounds. right on the sideline. Pushing and shoving, Pachuri can't get on top of it. Oh, wow. Fighting he's, for it, body goes oh down. God. He still has it. Valderrama, pass back. Oh, oh my God. God. Oh, oh my Slide God. tackle, no whistle, and oh my God. <laughs> what a sequence of events there. <laughs> Jesus. God, I love that. Millette with the throw in. Larson, he passes it back to Millette and sends it forward. Sean, he can't quite trap it, and he's f fighting for it. Whistle against John He, and I don't know how I feel about that. But, I mean, that was just a screen. He was putting his body in the way. You got to expect to be pushed out of the way. Yeah. I like. I don't know. I don't like that. Maybe it's because I. I just. I don't know. Rivers with the free kick again. Sends it up to Lockwood. Nice header, over to the near side. Millet's there. Almost gets his head taken off by a kick. You know, I guess I'm just used to the more like physical, physical sports like football. Yeah. Like, and you can't even like shove people in this one. But I mean, it, or, like, soccer hops. can be a very physical sport at times, and we've definitely seen that in this game. There's the throw in sent towards the goal, and Bab scoops it up. Yeah, I have no doubt. I yeah. wasn't even worried that time. Yeah, I knew Bab had that one on lock. If someone else had gotten a foot on that, I don't know. But look at this punt by Bab straight to Pachuric. He can't five quite trap it. On him though, so yeah, we'll he's really goes. fighting for it. Pachuric is giving his all in this game. Weiss clears it out, and Storm comes up with it on the far side. He's got to keep it in bounds, and he will. Fasulo can't quite retain possession of the ball, but it'll be a Red Hawks throw in at midfield on the far side. Short throw into Larson. Ball's taken away from him and sent downfield. And a pass back to Bab, who will clear it out. Larson can't quite get the ball. Lockwood with it now, centering pass. And nice. Millette with some good defense. Lockwood sends it forward, looking for Sullivan. He was in the corner, centers it, and Millette intercepts the pass. Tron Min, up to his brother. Tron, he raises oh. the field, and he's tripped, holding his ankle uh, again. Again. Maybe got stepped on. I wouldn't be surprised. They were, like, right up against each other. That one. That'll definitely be a free kick. Mm -hmm. I imagine. Sure. Of course. That's the second time this happened. Maybe this could be like a reoccurring issue. Let's see how he feels. Yeah. How he walks. 
He's all right. There you go. I mean, the Sweet thing Jesus. is, <laughs> the thing is, I mean, he definitely. All of them can look like they're in serious pain when they want to, mm -hmm. but it's like you can't really tell sometimes, and so it's yeah. like maybe they're faking it, but like you can't tell until they get up and walk around. Mm -hmm. So you always said it's always a little bit of worry, even if you um, are pretty sure that they're faking it. Frazier with the free kick. Wow. Uh, midfield. What a kick it is. And Mandeville will grab it before it goes out of bounds. He could have just let it go out, honestly. Mm -hmm. um, Would have had the same effect. Yeah. Or maybe he really just wanted to punt it. Who knows? Good punt from him. Millette heads it, gets it to Chan Min. Can't quite keep possession of the ball. Lockwood will send it forward. Millette lets Bab scoop it up. Nice screen there. And Bab bowls it forward to Valderrama. Nice oh, pass nice. over to Chan. He, he is brought down. No. Okay. Nothing there. Nice pass back by Pachurik. Up to Chan. He, he works to the middle oh, of the field. Wow. Threading the needle. He might be looking for a pass. Who's it going to be to? He uh, sends it forward, and I thought that was going to hit the scoreboard. I also did think that. This has been an exciting game. And now Pachurik is coming off the field, and Roscoe Palmer comes no, back. Oh, okay, 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 okay. Honestly, I don't know. I don't know. I kind of liked how Pachurik was doing. He was putting a lot of effort into that. Yeah. Every second that he had on the field was, like, I... He could have broken away from everyone, and I wouldn't have been surprised in the yeah. slightest. He was putting a lot of energy into that. Nice header by Larson, trying to get it up to Palmer. And now Millette sends it up to Larson again, and they can't Oof. keep it in bounds. Throwing going to be taken by Marino. Oh, nice header. Yeah. Oh, nutmeg. That was a great pass by Valderrama. Chan He with it now sends it forward to Palmer. Oh, here Roscoe we go. Palmer. Sends it forward, and again, Oof. too far ahead of Valderrama. Been happening all day today. Yeah. And if the Red Ox can pull off the win today, that is the one thing that they really need to work on, I think. Just getting their uh, passes down, being able to uh, lead the uh, lead their teammates more with the passes. Oh, Palmer. Trying wow. to intercept the throw in there. He's, He's really <laughs> pushing it. <laughs> Sean, he comes up with it. Moving forward, surrounded by Orioles, and he oh. tries to get into the oh. Oh. goalie box. Oh. Sean Min, his little brother, oh. looking for a shot on goal, is headed up in the goalie box. Sean Min's right there, trying to bring it down. Palmer now, they got an opportunity shot. Oh, oh. oh. crossbar, are you oh. kidding me? God. Oh. Tearing my heart out, man. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> The closest play we've seen all day to put some kind of points on the board. <sighs> and it's coming from the senior Roscoe Palmer. I it's need just, that. I need that. yeah. I think, we, I think we all need a little bit of peach tea in our lives. Get a sip. You need it. There we go. Sean He sent down hard. That would be a free kick, and he's getting shaken up out there. Sean Min, pass forward. Palmer, top of the goal box. Larson trying to get to it. He will on the near side now. Three people on him. He's still fighting for it. And now Lockwood oh. shoves down Sean He, and there's another Dude, whistle. I, he's just getting out. Are you kidding me? This is ridiculous. Like he's, he's taking a break there. <laughs> yeah. I don't blame him, man. And there's their number one fan right there. <laughs> Lockwood is going to be... Look at this, man. Lockwood is getting taken off after that. And I think that's a good call by the coach. Mm -hmm. Looking like that guy, coach down there is a little upset at him. Yeah, I would be too with that amount of penalties against one guy. This shot right off the head. And there's oh another head by the same guy goes out of bounds. Valderrama is going to take the throw in for the Red Hawks. Wastes no time. Sends it over to Larson. Larson, short pass forward to Chan He. Sent back to Valderrama. Across the field looking for Fasulo. But Chan Min will come off of it after the header. Pass over to Fasulo. Far side. He's going to try and work towards the middle. Top of the goalie box shot. And it goes wide right. All right. All right. 
some good opportunities, the momentum of the game has definitely changed. Okay. Timeout? I think so. Yeah, I think there's going to be a timeout here. Yeah. All right. So there's 14 minutes left on the scoreboard clock. We'll likely get a couple more than that with uh, yeah, the extra, extra time, time that they add on. It's still a scoreless game, and I mean, my God, what a game it is. This is, going into this, I mean, Belchertown I knew was going to be a tough team with their 9-5-3 and three record. I think that's what it is, if I remember that right. But with only one loss on the season, you got to expect the Red Hawks to, you know, pull off some kind of a lead, even if it ends up being a close game at the end. But yeah. neither team has been able to score. No. And it's... It's really, it's really something, I gotta say. Um, both teams looking pretty exhausted. Mm -hmm. um, and I would like to mention that, like, it's not like one team has had the ball for the most game. It's been like, sometimes Frontier will have it for like a bunch, and then it'll switch to Belcher yeah. Town being like dominant over it. And it's just going like back yeah. and forth, a push and pull. Absolutely. Thing. There's nothing. There's no one dominating this game in any no, sense. No, no, no. At it's a very all. even game. Whew. Fire. Team's coming back out on the field after the timeout. You, you trying to hype them up? Hyping myself up. Yeah. Getting ready for this. <laughs> Ooh. Last 10 minutes. Ooh. It's, it's, there's, there's 14 Don't. minutes. Don't. Okay. <laughs> 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 All right. Gold kick is going to be taken by Mandeville. Boo. All the way out to midfield. Gets by a couple people. And here's a pass forward on the near side. Nice header back to the center, but it's going to be intercepted by Larson. Behind the back pass. By Valderrama, it doesn't work out, and Babel will have to scoop that up. Who's number two? That's McDonald. Okay. The punk from Bab brought down by Chan Min, sent over to his brother. Pass forward, Palmer racing for it. It'll be scooped up by Mandeville just in time. We've seen, you know, I was kind of expecting... If it was close, a little closer than that, I wouldn't have been surprised if Palmer had gone like ran right into Mandeville. Oh, we've seen sure. him do that before. Mm -hmm. Storm, who is it going to be out on? It'll be Red Ox throwing. Looks like the sun's finally leaving us for a bit. Yeah, we can sit back down. Nico Fasulo on the far side works his way to the middle, looking for someone to pass to. It'll be Chan He in the middle of the field. Nice stutter step. Ooh, Palmer uh, can't bring oh. it down. Unfortunate. And Valderrama is going to have to get it. He will. Heads it over to Chan He, and it's sent to Millet. I thought that was going out. Valderrama isn't there in time. And Garoppolo now. Andrew Garoppolo gets the kickoff, and he'll find his way back to it again. And it's sent into the fans. <laughs> that was Jack Carey trying to grab the ball out of the air on the sideline. Header by Millette, out of bounds. Throw in for the Orioles. Okay. Going to be taken by Marino. Sent forward into the goal box. What a touch there by Lockwood. And I think that was meant to be a shot. And is going to stay in bounds. It is. Great play there. I couldn't see the number. Oh, Fasula with the deflection. Wow. I th Ooh, that could have been, like, good. <laughs> yeah, that was Missy Isaac who was setting up for the big kick there. Lockwood heads it forward. Garoppolo meets it. And now Fasulo has it. Gets tripped up and brought down. Missy Isaac sends it across the field. Valderrama tries to clear it, and he can't. Can't really get the head off, and he goes uh, down. Ooh. He's holding his leg, and he seems to be in a lot of pain. I think he might have pulled his calf muscle. What could I have? Yeah. Or cramping his calf. That's what I meant. Yeah, sorry. I <laughs> pulled it. Yeah. No, that, uh, pulling the muscle is a lot worse than cramping your muscle. So. 
Oh, and look at this. The Belchertown coach coming out with some water for him. Oh, sweet. He seemed like a really nice guy. I got the roster from him earlier. And he, he complimented our work. He said that it sounded like we were having a lot of fun. And I think we that's do. We do. When, 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 our team, when it's a good game or our team is winning, yes, we are. Except the unless it's like <laughs> last night. <laughs> the football game. Not that so was, I mean, fun. like, yeah, they lost. I think the most uh, upsetting part about that game was Aiden Dredge's injury. And I, I just really hope he's doing okay, man, because that didn't look really good. <laughs> and here's, yeah, Evan Orton's coming out on the field to help him out. I think it probably was just a cramp. Yeah, I think it is a cramp. Must I mean, like, still, just yeah, stretch it out. Make sure you're Give okay. It time. Yeah, take your take your time getting better. And it looks like I think Gus Radner is right there by him. If he wants to come off, yeah, he limps off the field, and Radner is going to take his position on the field. Frontier has to hope that he's going to be back on the field soon. He's very much an instrumental part of their offense. Yeah. Always playing very oh. aggressive and giving them plenty of opportunities. I got a good crack there. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Let's see if Gus Radner can fill his shoes. We have to hope so. No, he sits behind me in chemistry. Really? Yeah. I don't have any classes with him. 11.30 on the scoreboard clock. Millette clears it out. Met by Lockwood. And now Larson. Nice pass up to Chun Hee. He's tripped up a little bit. Mm -hmm. Radner can't get to it in time, and it'll be out of bounds on Ian McDonald. Big throw in from Millette. Palmer's there. Palmer works back a little bit, slows it down, tries to pass it over to Chun Hee. It's deflected into the goal box. Pass back to Mandeville, and he clears it out. Larson heads it, can't quite get it forward. Garoppolo has to fight for the header, and Larson, that was a dangerous yeah. kick. That Let's almost ended up. really badly. Uh, Fasulo, ooh, look at that. Oh, oh wow. wow. Fasulo, he's still going on the far side. Brought down. Okay. okay. And they're going to blow a whistle on Palmer. <laughs> but not nah, Fasulo's trip? Uh, rigged. <laughs> okay. I wasn't gonna say that. I was just gonna say that's a dumb call. <laughs> CJ Rivers taking the free kick again for the Orioles. Sends it way downfield in front of the goal box. Millett heads it forward. Palmer trying to get to in time against Rivers. He will. Tries to pass to Chan Yi, and there he is. Chan Yi gets in front of his defender. On his way down the field, he's tripped up and brought down. Oh, Radner, there's no whistle. And there's a whistle there. What? Who's paying these refs, man? <laughs> That's all I'm saying. Are, are you kidding me? That's the stupidest call I've seen all season, except for the call okay. last night where they, I'm not, they they shut up the pep band. Uh -huh. That is ridiculous. I'm not a conspiracy theorist. I promise. There's no that the game's not rigged. It's a high school soccer game. Who's gonna that be? was a ridiculous call. That's was, all I'm I, will, I will agree it, it was a bad call, in my opinion. But who was rigging a high school soccer no game? No one's rigging. I didn't say this. that. Hey, you did. I didn't you say that. Did. I just you said that it was a stupid said, call. Who's paying these refs? Yeah, pay whatever, pay whatever, some different refs whatever, to cover whatever, this game. Pay whatever. some better refs that are actually going to call the penalties. <laughs> That's all I'm saying. Sean Min with the ball. Ooh. Oh, now they call it. Okay, awesome. I honestly don't know what that call was for. That looked like an honest collision. Yeah, I don't know. Anyway, Frazier's going to take the free kick. Sent way downfield. Looking for Palmer. He lets it go by him. And now Fasulo has the ball. Both of them go down. He's trapped the ball in between yeah, his legs. Maybe. Dangerous play. That's, that's what we call that, buddy. You can't do that. <laughs> yeah. That's what that's the name for the penalty. That's the like of the two penalties I know. That's the name for that. Dangerous play. Dangerous play. Yeah, when you're like you're trying to c control the ball while you're on the ground. Because mm. I mean, what are they gonna do? They're gonna start kicking you in the back. Yeah. And the ball's just outside the penalty box. Oof. So no penalty kick. Yeah, no penalty kick. But, but this could. This is still like close to it. Sean He takes the free kick. Centering pass. Oh, Larson oh. gets by him. Gets by everyone.
one, and Fasulo now on the far side of the field. Let's see what he can do. Works his way into the corner, turns the corner, keeps it in bounds, and it's sent out. Corner kick for the Red Ox. <sighs> Seven minutes, or eight minutes, eight minutes, actually. Yeah. Mario! We got some really adamant fans here today. <laughs> yeah, they from are both sides. yelling from both sides. Oh, well, here you go. There's Valderrama coming back on for Radner. There we go, there we he go. He did a good job in Valderrama's absence. Not a lot of opportunities for him, but... There's a time to bring one of your starters back on. This it's is now, it. yeah. John He with the corner kick. Oh. Cleared out a little bit, and the Red Ox will let it go out of bounds. Free throw, not for <laughs> throw in. <laughs> My God, are you kidding me? For putting in basketball terminology in a soccer Ooh. game? Ooh. Spin Ooh. move. Valderrama sends it forward, and he falls down. Fasulo gets it in the far corner, and it's going to be another corner kick. Johnny has got his work cut out for <laughs> Yeah, with these quarter gigs made, running all the way across the field and everything. Hey, watch the short. Watch the low. Watch the shorts. Watch the low. <laughs> That's what the coach is saying. Here's the kick from the far side of the field. Chan He sends it in. Oof. Cleared out. Chan Min. Oh. Pass to Larson. He gets it again. Fasulo, oh, plenty oh, of time in the room, oh, makes the shot, oh, moves it in. Oh, 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 oh. sends it just wide. Oh my god. I think that's going to be another corner though. <laughs> they're say Yeah, they're saying it was deflected. <laughs> Dude, three in a row. Are you kidding me? Oh, this is ridiculous. Oh, Valderrama's taking this one. Ooh, switching it up. <sighs> oh my god. Oh, here we go, man. Valderrama takes the kick, sends it in. Sent back to him by the Orioles. Headed back to him by Chan Min. Nice touch. On the near side now. He's up against two defenders. Oh, what the? And what happened there? Who's ball? Okay, that's Belchertown's ball there. Belchertown's ball. It'll, they'll just have to move it back. Valderrama holding his leg again. And Chan He will just help him up. Stretching it out, it looks like. Yeah, and he'll come off the field. Radner comes on. Okay. And that's especially especially if the Red Hawks can pull off this win and move to the next round. That's going to be a worry for them in the next game. Yeah. Whoever it ends up being against. We'll know who uh, they're playing against later tonight. Uh, the game is uh, Hampshire against Monument Mountain at 5 p.m. Oh! Radner. <laughs> he went up for that. <laughs> Putting in the work, man. Throw in, taken by Marino. Lockwood sends it forward. Garoppolo clears it out. A little bit too far to the right for Palmer, but Fasulo is there. He gets it by the defender, and Palmer racing back for it. Sent forward by the Orioles. Frazier is there. He's got to clear it out. Works his way to the sideline, and pass is intercepted by the Orioles. Some nice footwork. Whoa. He gets really tripped up. And the pass is too far ahead. Oh, he keeps it in bounds. Ryan trying to clear it out now. Can't quite do it. Centering pass. Nice head. Storm is there. And Sean Min. Orioles still have the ball in the goal box. Nice. Cleared out by Storm. Sean He is there to meet the ball. Orioles take possession back on the near side. Centering pass. Garoppolo heads it over to Millette. And Garoppolo oh, will kind of flub kick. the kick. Can't quite oh, clear it. And it's out of bounds yeah, on the Red Hawks. Just get it out of there. <laughs> My God, this is... It's just, I mean, Red Hawks just had three corner kicks in a row. Four corner kicks, maybe. I can't really remember. What? what I don't know. I don't know what happened there. Yeah, I don't know what that call was about. Um, Do I? It's going to be a free kick, though. Oh, man, yeah, I don't know. This is... Great opportunity for the Orioles here. Let's see what they do. They send it into the crowd. Oh. Header, and Radner is there. Get it out. He'll send it back out. Sent towards the goal. Bab is there to grab yeah. it out of the air. That's my goalie. That was Trevor White wow. trying to send it forward. And he hucks it down the field. Fasulo, here's an opportunity for him. He's got Palmer in front of him, and Radner on the far side. Oh, he flipped up big time. What? No whistle. Is there a whistle? I couldn't hear it. Okay, there funny. was. Okay. <laughs> We get a call now, <laughs> right in front. That one got me emotional. Yeah, that one got me emotional. He basically did a flip, <laughs> is what he is what happened. Okay. 
<laughs> he got me screaming. Yeah. Bro. I'm blowing out the mic with my L. Yeah. <laughs> so here's a free kick right in front of the goalie box. Chani is going to take it. There's a wall being set up by the Orioles. Here's the kick. And it's wide left. Barely. By about a foot and a half. Yeah. Oh, he's upset with himself. Yeah, I don't blame him. That was a great opportunity. Really well placed kick. Are you kidding me, man? Well, Get I'm broadcasting too. Get on your this camera. This is ridiculous. <laughs> Tyler. <laughs> <laughs> you can't do that to me. <laughs> <laughs> well, you know, maybe this is what Belcher Town's coach meant by it. Sounds like you guys are having a lot of fun <laughs> on the podcasts. Oh, nice head. Larson putting some effort in. Valderrama meets Whoa, the ball. What a, what, what, I don't know what, what that was, but it was impressive. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> It'll get away from him, though, and it's a throw-in going to be taken by Nathan Marino. Wind's picking up a little bit again. Yeah. Sun is nowhere in sight, and yeah. we're under two minutes on the scoreboard clock. Oh. Out on Valderrama. Yeah. I feel like Valderrama's getting a little risky with some of these moves. Yeah, I agree. He's really trying to make something happen for his team. and I mean, I can't blame him, but let's try and keep it in check. Weiss sends it forward and oh. bat it. Three feet over everyone. <laughs> Are you kidding me? Like... <laughs> He's just a, a hulking man. It's incredible. It really is. And a beautiful kick, too. John He can't get on top of it. But it's sent back. And a nice kick forward by the Orioles. Garoppolo heads it out of bounds. Lockwood takes the throw in. Sent forward to Cayenne. Cayenne against Valderrama, working his way back. Pass back to Lockwood. He sends it forward towards the goal and back. No, no, Knocked down. No, no, no. He's got to get back and go quick. Oh. And it's out of bounds. <laughs> that was scary. Oh my God. And Oliver's on the ground. That was way too... <sighs> wow. Garoppolo taking the kick. Second time we've seen him do that today, giving Bab a little bit of a break. Gets it to about midfield and Lockwood. Can they keep it in bounds? They will. He's up against Fasulo. Fasulo. That's regulation. Well, wait. My so God. What happens? So we're going to be going to overtime when we come back. There is no, no one has been able to score. We've seen great opportunities from both teams. And I, I don't know what to say, man. This is just about one of the tensest games I've ever seen. And I, I don't really know how it works. I don't know if it's like someone scores and then that's it kind of thing or is it they just they just have a set amount of time and then they they play it out whatever happens happens but I, if 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 the overtime ends with still a tie game we could be going to a shootout and that might be this like the most that, tense moment of my life i i might have a heart attack well We'll have to see what happens when we come back from this quick break at the end of the regulation. It is tied 0-0. What a game. You're watching Frontier Community Access Television. Hello and welcome back to Frontier Community Access Television. I'm still Mason Smith. Here with Oliver Cox, yeah. Tyler Wolkowitz, Elijah Rain Phelps, all the rest of the FCAT crew. What a game this is. This It's 0-0, zero, zero, and we have, according to the scoreboard clock, we have 10 minutes of overtime that are going to be played right now. Uh, I don't really know what happens if no one scores in that ten yeah. in those 10 minutes. If it goes to shootout, I don't know but if I can handle it. I have never That's seen a high school soccer game go to overtime in the first place. So this is a first for me. Palmer oh almost takes the ball away oh right off the bat. And now the Orioles with an opportunity. Some nice passing there. Sean Min intercepts it. I need to figure out who 12 is. Who's 12? He's getting the ball a lot. I can't find his number. Um, <laughs> I hate it when the... Sean Min goes the, down. I hate it when the rosters aren't numerical. I know. Hold on. 
Oh, it's Marino. He was right there, right where my thumb was. <laughs> and I couldn't. Jeez. <laughs> Throwing by Storm, sent forward by Larson. Larson fighting for it. He'll come up with it. Some nice footwork, and he passes it forward. Palmer's there. Let's see what Palmer can do. He'll pass it forward, intercepted by Rivers. And now Storm can't steal the ball. And on the far side of the field now, Orioles pass deflected a little bit. Valderrama can't bring it down. Larson flubs the kick, and he goes down. Okay. So that looked really awkward. It yeah. worried me for a second there. John Mann can't quite clear it. It's deflected. Storm. It's getting scary, man. Ball sent forward. Millet heads it back. Chan Min. Two in a row. There's three. He goes Palmer. down, but Palmer's there on the near side. Let's see what Palmer's going to do. He's got a couple of Orioles in front of him. Chan He, too. Cross the field. Deflected. for Fasulo. Oh, oh. He's got an opportunity. Oh. Fasulo shoots. Oh. Oh. Fasulo. Oh. Yeah. The Red I've never seen anything like it before! Oh my god! It's a miracle! Let's go! Have fun with that, Audio Murphy. <laughs> oh my god! What an assist by Palmer! Shirts are off! And now the question is, do they call it at that? I don't know. Was it just a sudden death, or are they going to let the 821 run out on the clock? I don't know, man. I'm just extremely happy right now. I think I think that's it. Yes. <laughs> There's your ball game. <laughs> the Frontier Red Hawks. A minute 19 into the first overtime. Nico Fasulo scores the game winning goal, <laughs> assisted by Roscoe Palmer. And my legs are shaking, man. Oh my God. <laughs> <laughs> I can't. I, I, I'm trying to stay upright. Is what's going on? <laughs> that is the most incredible game I've ever seen in my life. The Red Hawks win the Western Mass semifinals against Belcher Town, and they will advance to the Western Mass finals. They're either going to be playing against Monument Mountain or Hampshire, and. If, the, It'll, if it's it, anything it like if it's, if it's anything like this game, I'm, I might I have a heart attack watching care. that. I, I, like, don't, I don't care how far the drive is. I'm making it to that game. That's what I'm saying, man. If I have to tag along along with the soccer team, I will. And everyone who's wa who is just finished watching this, you better come out to that game if you get the chance to, because I mean these guys are just incredibly talented. Ed. Oh my god. Oh my god. That, that's all you can say. A 1 0 win in the Western Mass semifinals in the most miraculous way possible. Everyone on the field still in disbelief. I'm still in. I'm, I, I'm like trying to process what happened. Uh, yeah, I. Oh my god. <sighs> And we also got word that, uh, I think that uh, Tom covered the volleyball game today in Chicopee, but uh, Frontier's volleyball team uh, won, uh, I think, the Western Mass Finals today. Yeah, yeah. So I don't know how many years in a row it is. It's somewhere close to 20, I'm pretty sure. Uh, congratulations to them. They deserve it. And I, <sighs> this soccer team deserves to win the finals, too. I might they, have to win. <laughs> the wind's picking back up again, and I wow, just what what a wow. game! There's nothing else to say besides that. Do you have anything else you want to add, Oliver? Western Mass, we're winning it. It's gonna be we're winning. It's gonna hey, be quite a game. Look at me in my eyes. We're winning. We're Western winning. Mass. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Well, all right, so we've got places to be, so do we? Uh, well, I do. <laughs> so the Frontier Red Hawks 
pull off the win in the Western Mass semifinals against the Belchertown Orioles, getting revenge for their football team. Yeah. In a game-winning goal by Nico Fasulo, assisted by Roscoe Palmer, a minute and a half into overtime. And what a game it was. We'll see you when we cover the finals game sometime later this week, probably. Oh, yeah. I've been Mason Smith, Oliver Cox, You're? Tyler Wolkowitz, Elijah Rain Phelps, all the rest of the FCAT crew. Thank you so much for tuning in today. I hope you enjoyed this game as much as I did. We'll see you in the Western Mass finals. You've been watching Frontier Community Access Television.